truth. <laughs> if having a ships, you need it. <laughs> have a ships? I haven't turned it on yet. I want to see yes. how well my work was. Um, uh, seems a beast. The hinge is nice and tight. The screen doesn't bounce. Hit the power button. Does it come on? Yay! F10. Time is not right. Sure. Yeah. Uh-oh. Wait, hold on. Control up. Delete. I want to hit F10 to go into the setup. Entering setup. Thank you. Yay. System infos. Core 2. 2 gigahertz. 64K L1, 4K, 4 meg L2, uh, 4 gigs of RAM, bio state. I gotta update that. And then, um, yeah. yeah, so it's T7200. Oh, no, no. Yeah, that is true. When you log into the little computer, you, you um, have uh, Outlook, which I'm making storage information for you. So, so, I'm just trying to get this part done. So um, log in. Make sure um, everything's found. So Sure, sure, sure. Yeah. You might as well call the OC title. Oh, oh sorry. I can it enable that. It doesn't matter. Um, I'm going to turn that on. Probably through red mail. Log in computers. And so, cool. of course, you do secondary back. Yeah, you can't even get to the... Uh, what we'll do is we'll try this one more time. Yeah. What do they have? Mid shift? Mm -hmm. Don't know what the difference is. I'll figure that out. I'm not taking lunch today. Nope. I'm done. So I'm gonna boot it up into Windows and we're done. I'm gonna. What do you mean you're yeah. So some of the features in the BIOS was playing with it. Um. The sanitizer. That's cool. Okay. You're probably connected now to the. So. It's probably a. So cool. Save changes and exit. F10. Cool. And it's probably gonna say the art real time clock is wrong. But if that's the case, I'll yeah, time and date not set. No problem. I can do that in Windows. So start Windows normally. Cool. We're done. Yay. Motherboard swapped. I'm gonna uh. Go into Windows, make sure it detects the processor correctly, and um, and then I'm going to eventually move this stuff over to a solid state. So, because it's taking too long to boot. So, yeah, it's too long. Yeah, check that box. I'll go away until next time. Oh god. So worky. Uh, okay. Well Yeah, it's too long. Okay, I'm gonna pause it and wait for it to log in. Okay, so here we go. It attacks the dedicated video memory is 128 mags on the X thirteen hundred, which is exactly what we wanted. And it detects the CPU G seventy two hundred two gigahertz. So cool. I need to rerun re this, but I don't know if it'll let me until I reboot the computer. So, yeah. Yeah, it won't let me until I reboot. So let me go ahead and reboot. And then, uh, also on the side note, I had to change the time and date because it kept telling me that my, um, it was January 4th, 1980. So I had to, um, reset. um, check the, the time, so, you know, update the time. Okay, I was able to get this to update, but it went to the same numbers it was at before. So, so it really, nothing changed. But the machine is a lot. It feels much faster, probably because of CPU. And, but I'm going to throw an SSD in here later today, and I'm going to show that that's step two.
um, this should work on most Windows computers, so it's not particular to this computer, to per se. But um, so it's um, something that I'm gonna show here. But yeah, <coughs> for a forty dollar upgrade, it's not bad. You know, twenty seven ninety for the motherboard and about fifteen bucks for the CPU. It's not bad. So. Um, and it works. So, um, restarted it again, and then I'm gonna um, um, start cloning over the drive to the SSD. So, uh, so thank you. This is this will complete the motherboard swap and upgrade. So, so thanks. Bye. Please comment.